Hello, I'm the critic. I remembered so you don't have to. Today we're going to look at Les Miserables. Today we're going to look at Les Miserables, which was a movie. <clears throat> which was a movie that was based on a theater play, which was based on a book by Victor Hugo. And if you've never heard of this film, you may know of one of the actors who was famously known for having a bad singing voice in this film. Yeah, this uh, a play about singing where one of your actors can't sing. Weird. But what I think of Les Miserables was... Good from what I saw. From what I can remember, it was about this poor thief who becomes... The mayor of the town, I guess. In France of 1812, I think. Or 1808, I forget. But it was before the French Revolution. So when the French Revolution hits, that's when the second half of this movie really picks up. Because then he turns into this, like, king guy-ish almost. He becomes the mayor. Runs the town. And then this cop who's been chasing him for years actually finally meets him, but he doesn't remember him after so long. So yeah, they play with that idea. It's well played, and there's also a little girl in this who can't find her family, but it's really good. It's 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 really dignified. I really enjoy it. If you can find it anywhere, please watch it. I couldn't find any clips. Because the movie's just that good. Because if I showed clips, that would ruin the point of what the movie is. It's just that good. Now for the second movie. Footloose. I liked Kevin Bacon. He was nice. It was really hammy, but that's what the film was. Funny and exciting. For those of you, or some of you, who don't know what this film is about. It's basically about a town... That is outlawed musical dancing. Yeah, musical dancing. It sounds like an atlet, but no, that's literally what this film is. So yeah, then they try to get music back to the farm, to this place. And they've even remaked it, like once, like... But it wasn't as good as the Kevin Bacon one. The Kevin Bacon one was amazing. Because if you ask me, the musicals actually fit the point. Like, there's a famous song by Bonnie Tyler called Hero in there. Really good. I would show clips, but I'm afraid of copyright strikes and all that. So, yeah. If you could get a chance, go find it yourself. Until then... I forgot we had a guest. So goodbye.